Hi friends, it's time for us to read chapter three of Dragon Tales. We've been reading a chapter book. Now, in chapter one, we learned that Dragon wanted a friend. And if you remember, that snake tricked him and pretended to be the apple. So Dragon's new friend is an apple. In chapter two, Dragon took Apple home. Now it's time for chapter three. Dragon Tales. We know tale means a story. And let's read chapter three. Here's my table of contents and I see that chapter three starts on page 25. The pages go in number order and here we are. Chapter three, the new day. Let's find out what happens with Apple and his uh, Apple and his friend Dragon. The next morning, Dragon awoke with the sun. Good morning, Apple, said Dragon. The apple did not answer. So Dragon went out to the kitchen and made breakfast. When he was finished eating, he tried to wake the apple up again. Good morning, Apple, he cried. The apple still did not answer. So Dragon went outside for a walk along the river bank. When he came back, he tried to wake the apple up again. Good morning, apple, he screamed. The apple still did not answer. Dragon was very worried. He called the doctor. My apple won't talk to me, said Dragon. Maybe it's a crab apple, said the doctor. No, said Dragon, I think my apple is sick. So Dragon took the apple to the doctor's office. They sat down next to a big walrus. What's the matter with you? Said the walrus. It's my apple, said Dragon. It won't talk to me. The walrus stared at the apple and drooled. What do you think the walrus wants to do? Mm -hmm, he wants to eat that apple. Dragon needed a drink of water. Will you watch my apple for me? Dragon asked the walrus. Sure, said the walrus, licking her lips. Is this a good idea? When Dragon came back, the apple had changed. It was not round anymore. It was not shiny anymore. It was not red anymore. Now it was wet and skinny and white. What happened? cried dragon are you all right the little white thing did not answer dragon wrapped his friend in a piece of paper and carried it home don't worry said dragon everything will be okay when dragon got home the little white thing had turned all mushy and brown are you hurt asked dragon the mushy brown thing did not answer are you sick asked dragon but there was no answer. Are you dead? Asked Dragon. Still, there was no answer. Dragon scratched his big head and started to cry. So that's the end of chapter three. Please watch my next video and we'll read chapter four in the book Dragon Tales and we'll find out what happens with apple um, and dragon. So please watch. Thanks for watching.